This is Batman calling from Wayne Manor with a special announcement. From the great halls of their house, there are assembled three who hope to one day be the world's greatest driving heroes. Created from the cosmic legends of the universe comes our team captain, the Vision, Bill Fisher. And their soon-to-be Wonder Woman, Vicky Fisher. And our Captain Marvel and head flight trainee, Jennifer Scripchuk. Their mission, to fight injustice, share what is right and wrong, to get you out of your house and come out racing with them and serve all mankind. They are the Garage Heroes in Training Team. Welcome to the Garage Heroes in Training Podcast. I'm going to be your host for this episode, and we may stop early because there's a live band out the track tonight. Who's hosting? I'm Vicki. I'm Jennifer. And she's very far away. She's got to lean in, but that's fine. We got this covered. Uh, we are reporting in live from New Jersey Motorsports Park Lightning Track. We had an HBDE Day 1 today. Uh, we're going to start with Great. Vicki. Awesome. Vicki, how was your day? It was pretty darn good, I have to say. It, um, I am leveled up to HP, HPDE2, and it has been, um, I would have to say it's mostly track time. I can't really say that we're... Who are we with? Who are we with? What oh. group are we with? Oh, we are with, oh my gosh, was, we've been doing yeah. so much. NASA Northeast. You were at the NASA Northeast, my bad. So, um... Yeah, but there's just been, it's been good. That's all I can say. Track time is good. It's awesome. I'm having a great time. Okay. <laughs> Details. Those, I feel like I was there with that kind of detail. Um, so, Vicki, you are driving? My 1999 Miata NB. With a turbo. With a Flying me out of turbo. Jennifer, you're driving? It's a 2019. 2019 Miata ND. There you go. Look mm -hmm. at that. ND2 if we want to get fancy. And I am finally able to buy a car that is actually an HBDE car that I can actually use. That doesn't stand for NB. does not stand for not Bills. And ND does not stand for Jennifer steals it all the time. So Bill has a 2004 BMW M3 with um we just changed the smg to a true manual so now it has three pedals which is always awesome uh we are riding on the njmp lightning track vicky nickname the dong anyway uh apparently it likes hostess dongs uh or something like that we'll go with that um jennifer is in hpd1 vicky is in hpd2 i am in hpd3 we proliferate around this entire place uh, Vicky, it's your first time in two. Tell me, tell me some stories. Well, HPDE two um, for here, it is mostly just track time. I would have to say, um, yeah, fast cars, uh, definitely riding the line. All of them are riding the line. <laughs> it's all about the point by so apparently. Meaning. Meaning that everybody. Everybody being following the line and me entering into uh, HPDE2, um, right now I am leveling up in speed to them and uh, not focusing so much on just instruction, just using everything that I've been using so far, that I've learned so far in HPDE1. And your comments were about the debrief, right? Yeah, the debrief. Um, so for the debrief, um, I believe his name is, is, it's not Enrique. Yeah, Enrique. Sorry. Enrique. Okay, so I have Enrique again. And Enrique is a great storyteller. And so I, I think our instruction is based on storytelling. So, but he's, he's, he's good. And, you know, he's there to answer all the questions. I did meet my instructor again, um, uh, Yuko. And she was with me when I was in uh, Watkins Glen. And she also has a Miata with me about the same year. And she hopped in the car. We recognize each other. She hopped in the car and said, hey, what have you been up to? And I said, hey, I've been training. She was, let me see what you learned. And we kind of 
did some loops on the track. Was she disappointed? Uh, slightly. <laughs> <laughs> well, and, no. The only reason the only reason was my first. It was very embarrassing. My first trip out on the track, um, I, my tech wasn't up to snuff yet, so I had to straighten out my belts a little bit, and then we just again, you know, our own stinking electronics, which kind of delayed with everybody kind of rolling in late, and so me going out onto the track, it was. Um, a little bit stressful and she just happened to be in my car so once i kind of got my bearings bound down you know things started getting better okay miss jennifer i believe you met a uh, podcast listener in your class yay i did his name was gordon he came over to me and i'm sorry i did his <laughs> name was gordon um he came up i guess he, i was wearing my sweatshirt that had uh, garage heroes and training on it so he Came up and he goes, oh, I was listening to your podcast on my way here. Yeah. I was like, oh, great. I really like it. It's the first time that's happened. Hi, Gordon. I like we have, you know, a gazillion fans. Which part of your family are you from? (laughs) So I was a little, I mean, I was a little stunned, but. I was like, well, so where are you from? And he, he said he knew somebody or somebody. Said, I don't know. I couldn't remember who he said. He didn't know him anyway. But he said he was from Baltimore. <laughs> or the Baltimoreans, probably. Baltimoreans. Oh, I don't know. Maybe. I don't know. But yeah. So anyway, I um, came back and I was telling Vicky and Bill, and Bill gave me some stickers to give to him. So I went and I gave him some stickers, and he came and and found me and gave us some stickers. Oh, we like stickers. Yeah. Sticker swap. Sticker swap. Uh, sticker swap. It was pretty awesome. How's HBD one? It's wonderful. It, my instructor. I like my instructor a lot. He's in car. He's just in. He, well, yeah. In the car. Seems nice. Pops down. Yeah, he seems really nice. Very young. Seems <laughs> very young. <laughs> But he's he um he's very calm. So I mean it's yeah, I mean it's a I'm progressing. Yes, you are. Good. Yes. Anyway. How about you, so Bill? How about you, Bill? <laughs> Tell us all about it. HPE three. Uh what are you learning it? Limited up in there? limited point buys, it's track day. We're not learning anything. Uh debriefs are basically point by discussions. It's not yeah. not a lot there. Um, so driving the M3 for the first time, the goals coming into the weekend were get used to the car, relearn the track. I'm actually able to see the track since I'm not driving behind a piece of steel with holes in it. Um, tune into our earlier episode, the last time we were at NJMP in the Lightning, and uh, I broke the windshield. But <laughs> say anything about that. Uh, so the track looks a whole lot different <coughs> looking through glass and not that eating, not eating oil. <laughs> Um, so got used to the car, uh, issues with the car, uh, the, I miss, hey, don't just pretend we're not on the podcast over there. Um, so issues with the car, uh, I've gotten used to what we use for tires for our endurance racing. And these are all season tires and they're, they're not what I'm used to. So they're a little slippery here, which isn't bad. Uh, the big issue is I'm really used to uh, racing brakes, and these are not. And uh, it basically, I get one lap, one good lap of using brakes, and then the rest of it is, you know, nurse it all the way around. So, uh, times are pretty good, consistent. Um, one of the nice things was my my fast time and my letting the brakes cool down time aren't missing. They're off by like 0.6 or 0.7 seconds, so that's yeah. not too bad. Uh, and uh, otherwise, it is just you guys said you want more lap time, so I got you lap time, track time. Yes. So I'm running out now an HPD two with. This is the first time my car has been on this track with the what are our tires that we use? Uh, RS fours, but you're not riding those. Oh, I'm not riding those. Um, but I do have the new Bilstein struts. Stuff. Yeah. Yeah. And it feels like a different car. It, it really does. So I'm actually getting a little bit more confidence with the car going around the track. And I'm, I am trying to trust the tires. And um, 
So trying to trust the tires, trying to trust the speed, and then trying to actually not jerk my car around. But as it comes to that, um, one thing I am realizing with my car is that my car um, with the turbo is the engine is getting too hot. I, I think it's getting too I have to get off the track and I have to lift my hood. So I'm thinking that we're going to go have to go ahead and cut the vents and add vents into the car. Maybe a bigger radiator. Yeah, or maybe even a bigger radiator, but it's just it's it's running too hot for doing what we're doing right now. If we only knew somebody knew something about Miatas. Alex The <laughs> unattended gigolo. <laughs> He was supposed to be here. Anyway. Uh, okay. So highs and lows for today. So what do you got? The, the high for me, um, you know what? Honestly, I'm, I'm learning and it is just being on the track. And I think that every time I'm on the track, I've been on there for three times or two times, so three, three times so far for the weekend. And I'm working on stabilizing the car. What does that mean? It, it it means that I'm not jerking the car around and I'm trying to actually level the car when I drive and keep it nice and smooth and keep my input smooth. So um, I don't want it to rock back and forth So and trying to keep it, you know, just even. So right now I'm trying to make sure that this particular time I'm, I'm running mostly in one gear and then saving the upper gear for, um, for the max out gear, which for me would be fifth on the straightaway. Yeah. Highs and low. My highs um, was probably, I was getting really comfortable with downshifting, going into it. Heel toe or just downshifting? No, just downshifting. That's fine. Yeah, they don't want us to do heel toe mm -hmm. right here, and you're, I don't blame them. You're in HPD one. Yeah. yeah. You should be starting. She should be. Well, my instructor was, well, I was impressed because he picked up on that. And like it was, it just worked really well. You know, we just started doing it and going around, and it was working. <laughs> anyway, I was getting pretty comfortable with it, so that was probably my high. Um, and I really like this track; it's fun. It's a fun track. Fast track. Well, it's, it's a fast it's track, fast as in track. as in being short. Yeah. It's and fast it's track. Period. Too. My my low. Oh my gosh, that sun on the last lap. <laughs> it, was, it was pretty low. It was so low. <laughs> going out. I, it was blinding. Going out from the oh pit. Oh my gosh, yes. Going out for the pit. Just it? sitting there going, I, I, I think the toe is right somewhere. Yeah. Right? Yep. Anyway. So what about you, Mr. Bill? Yeah, tell, tell us, Bill. So highs um thought the difference in speed of the car would have been a bigger deal actually it's not I, it was pretty comfortable i just, um wasn't as big of a concern as i thought it would be brake pads would be lovely uh anybody who's got some e46 m3 brake pads in the area please send them out i'm putting this podcast out please bring them by in the morning um we'll pay for it we will <laughs> uh lows um Tell us about it. Tell Bill. us. Tell us a story, Bill. Story or lows? I've got the one low that we don't want to say. Oh my gosh, there's two. Well, yeah. <laughs> the the hyperdrive dude and uh, uh, oh, we don't do hyperdrive dude. Yeah, he was. A bit of, no, we're not going to do hyperdrive. Bit of a weenie. Um, let's see. So, story time with Bill. How are you today? <laughs> so there I was swimming next to a dolphin with plaid shorts on. <laughs> So anyway, we go out for the fourth time today. Everybody, um, Vicky got four laps, four turns. Jennifer got four turns. I got four turns. I go out for my last one. It's uh, instead of being a 20 minute session, it's a 15 minute session. So it was the first time that I got behind somebody who decided that they were more Tyrannosaurus Rex than an orangutan. Uh, apparently their arm does not reach out past the side of their car and point people by. He did make up for it by being exceedingly slow. So that was beneficial. So I had somebody who doesn't point by and is slow. And as I said, with the brake pads that I have, I only have one lap where I can go hard or my brake pads start to get a little bit hot. And... Uh, not stop so well so anyway so he finally waves me by down the big back straightaway i'm going through i go in i'm a little inside i'm a little fast i hit the i hit the brakes 
barely make it through there. Life is good. I'm like, okay, we're in front of him. And way in the back. So go through turn two and turn three. They're basically one big turn. Go to turn four. Life is good. Turn five is the only other place on the track where you really need brakes. And um, I didn't have any at the time. <laughs> so I'm doing like, okay, what do I do? How do we do this? I'm. Um, it was one of those where I'm either going to make it or I'm going to just miss so I'm trying to make it so then I go to downshift and then I'm holding the ball of my shifter in my hand <laughs> and I figure I'm just going to go off now because <laughs> apparently the gods want me off this track so I just drive off the track and you know take, take a little take a little visit in the shrubbery this and, is uh, a debut on this car too it is it's the debut on this car so um, <laughs> I took I took it I took it for a little tour of the sites, you know. Got to see some of the gardens, some of the foliage. Uh, pulled around. I was out there. It felt like I was out there for like a day and a half. Drove around, pulled to the side of the track. It was kind of at a forty-five degree angle. I look over to the flagger. He's got his big yellow flag station. I give him a big old thumbs up, and right behind me, there's like eight thousand cars. <laughs> It was like flying inside a beehive. I'm like, I didn't know there's that many people in our whole lesson. But anyway, they're all right behind me, apparently. So I'm just waving to them. How you doing? What's up, boys and girls? But I went, that looks pretty fast. So, so I'm sitting there, and then everybody goes by and tracks by. And so I go back out there and, uh, you know, limp it around, do lots of point and buys, and uh, drove it into the, uh, the pit area and said, hmm. And then I tell... Uh, I tell Vicky that, you know, my shift my shift knob came off and she's like, Oh and she doesn't treat it like it's anything going on. So then she goes and gets gets in there and she starts fondling my shift knob of the car. And uh then she goes, Oh, you mean it came off? I thought you meant spin. I'm like, No, when I say my shift knob came off, I mean off if I said my shift knob spun. Okay, I, and and okay, so my shift knob in my N B it's just a spin. It's it's an individual piece, but apparently Bill's shift knob is actually attached to uh, the fabric that goes into um, the it car itself. The boot. Flaccid. The boot. The boot. Yeah. So it I mean, mine flaccid. mine I could just screw right off, and it's in my hand. And I'm like, yeah, just screw it back on. It's fine. And uh, and I walked in there. I'm like, well, okay, well, you guys can go look at the video. <laughs> so we've been married for twenty plus years. She does not realize that I use the word that I mean. If I say it came off, it's off. If I say it unscrewed, it's unscrewed. Oh when I say off, I mean O F F. Off. Okay? So. Uh, car's parked. Car's parked. Anyway, uh, I, I think I know how to fix that part. I don't know how to fix the brake pad part. We're going to think about bleeding the brakes. If not. Well, you said you need brake pads. I do need brake pads really bad. Um. <laughs> He, he said shred the tires, not shred the brakes. If I had known that, we would have brought brakes. Yeah, anyway. <laughs> who knew? Uh, I need brake pads. Brake pads. We're at uh, NJMP Lightning over by the go-kart track. Look for the big sign. It says Garage Heroes in Training. Uh, <laughs> if I don't get brake pads, help me, please. Um, I will be sharing a car with Jennifer tomorrow. Do there any race shops around here that would sell something? Uh, on a Sunday morning at no. 8 o'clock. So, anyway, it's all good. Uh, that little car can handle it. That's right. Jennifer and I we're going to share cars. I'm going to skip one session so that we don't have Pray any. It don't rain. It's not going to rain. Why can't you share my car? It's not Bill's. NB <laughs> short podcast. Anything else? Nope. All good. All good. All good. Short podcast. Brake pads. Garage heroes in training at Lightning Motorsport Park. M3 E46. Send them over. Cash money. Cash. But you could find it out here. All right. That's it. Short podcast. Hope everybody have fun. Uh, if you guys listen to this and we're still here, come on by. If you guys listen to this and we're not here, don't worry about it. We had fun anyway. So looking forward to tomorrow. Thanks, everybody. Have a great night. Bye. Bye. Bye.